Hello there. We've had a largely fine day of weather. A few showers in the north. They'll soon tend to decay. And it means for many the evening's looking largely fine. Dry with some decent spells of sunshine and generally feeling pleasantly warm. It's been fine because high pressures kept our weather fronts at bay until now. As we head through the next 24 hours, a deep low drives in from the west and those tightly packed ice bars represent it's going to turn very windy. But for the time being this evening, dry and bright through England and Wales. Scotland and Northern Ireland will have skies clouding over through the night and by tomorrow morning it's set to turn wet. Rain at this stage in the day, not too heavy, but it will turn pretty intense as we head through the early hours of tomorrow. Ahead of it we'll see more cloud pushing eastwards. So not the glorious sunny start we've seen over the last few days for Wales in the southwest of England. A rather cloudy start to the day here. Largely dry, but I wouldn't rule out across western coasts and hills a bit of a damp, drizzly start first thing tomorrow morning. Northern Ireland tomorrow gets off on a very wet note, a very windy one as well. Gusts coming in from the south up to 30, 40 miles an hour. Strengthening winds for western Scotland accompanied by this band of rain pushing eastwards. Pretty intense downfalls. We could see 30, 40, maybe 50 mils of rain before the end of the day is out. Starting to cloud over with rain for the northwest of England. A bright start for the Midlands with some spells of sunshine. But the southeast still holds on to this dry, warm weather. Just a little cloud developing through the day. So dry for Wimbledon, temperatures climbing into the mid-20s with a bit more of a breeze and a little bit more cloud. Now through tomorrow we will see the rain easing from Northern Ireland. Further heavy rain for Scotland, particularly in the west over higher ground. It will edge off into the North Sea and it's at this time where we start to see things turning rather showery. More rain into Northern England, Wales and the South West, damp and drizzly by now. And then that cloud spills ahead of the weather systems. And it's worth bearing in mind, not just wet tomorrow, also windy. The wind's strengthening through the course of the day, but strongest in Scotland during the evening hours. Very unseasonably strong winds, gusts of 60, perhaps 70 miles an hour. Now, thankfully, that low clears away for Monday. A few showers in the west still holding on to the sunshine in the south and east.